Okay, again, YouTube, this is Valksta once again, bringing you some more commentary. But this time I'm going to be doing some commentary for Guile's Child 20. Um, I, after, after like a couple days, I think two days ago, I received a comment on YouTube. And um, also, um, someone on the .org also had some problem with it still. So, um, yeah, it was, yesterday, it was a day ago. I received that comment, it was like 3 in the morning, uh, I decided to hop on my PS3 and do Trial 20 a couple more times. Um, it was like 3 in the morning, I was pretty dead out of it, but um, it's really uh, <laughs> it's really just combining the two moves of uh, um, the, the two parts, I mean, not the two moves, the two parts. It's the low uh, punch to the medium punch. You have to get that timing down. And like I said in the dot org, the, the two parts are very easy to link on their own. Uh, the low punch to the medium punch is very easy. Um, and um, uh, the flash, uh, or the, the sonic boom to the double flash is also very easy just doing it separately. But uh, for some reason, when you're actually trying to combine the two, it's your uh, one's brain can get, become really fuzzy. And I used to do this, uh, well, I was pretty tired upon recording this, and my mind was really out of it, and I was going to show you that um, you just take the time to um, uh, get, like, take the time to uh, practice one of these parts and then slowly implement them together. You'll be able to do this. Um, I was dead tired doing this. As you can see, it takes, it's trial and error, you know, you got to get the, the timing down. And uh, here on this part, you see all... Uh, um, I definitely could have that for the Sonic Hurricane, but I was in the corner. So it's happened to me countless times. And um, what you want to do is you want to every time you, uh, you you get to the corner, restart your game, restart the the um, trial, and uh, attempt from the middle again, or uh, use Gal to throw him to the other side. And um, it's just what I like. What I like to do is uh, I'll, I'll concentrate on just breaking the um, the the trial in half. I'll I'll focus on uh, getting the focus attack to the uh, the low punch to the medium punch into a sonic boom. And once you get that down a notch, uh, you'll just um, finish the combo with adding the, the double flash after that. Because actually, my mind just my 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 hand just do it all by themselves once I get to the, the um, uh, get to the part where I'm getting to the sonic boom already. And my mind just pretty much uh, will implement the sonic uh, or the, the double flash. And I was doing this so much. I was even doing some more today because I want to add some footage after I recorded a uh, uh, Cami's um, trials. And um, my thumb is actually kind of sore right now from all the holding. That's one of the flaws when you're using a holding character on the D-pad is that your thumbs will get sore from holding so much. And even the move can be easy as easy as hell, but uh, the more you hold. Uh, the more your thumbs are going to get sore. So my, the movement's already set in my mind, and right now um, I have the, uh, one of my habits, it's like a personality trait, is that I won't, uh, I usually won't stop until I finish one of the trials. So last night I was doing um, uh, Gal's Trial 20 again because I wanted to add some more footage to uh, this particular video, as uh, this was shot in um, uh, 40 minutes. Um, I think two days ago actually. It wasn't a day ago because last night I was actually doing um, some more of this. And my thumb was really sore just from doing um, um, I think it was Cami's trial. It was Cami's trial where you have to keep um, jumping and doing the um, uh, quarter circle backward kick motion and uh, I didn't actually, I forgot the strategy because I hadn't done it in so long and you actually have, it was actually doing the um, uh, you have to do the a down, backward to up forward motion, um, doing that, and uh, I you'll see I, I actually edited it out, but it's actually it was super easy once I figured it out. But after doing that for a while and attempt doing these guys trial twenty um, a couple of times, my thumb became really sore. So um, make sure when you're doing this, really think about what you're doing. I mean, it's it's pretty simple when you break the parts together. And as you can see, I'm like dead tired doing this, and of course it'll still take trial and error. Um, but.
but it's, it's really possible. Uh, I edited some parts out, but most of this is actually um, uh, shot. It's all shot uh, all together. And I missed a lot of the parts there because I was I was pretty sleepy. It was 3 a.m. in the morning when I recorded this, and I, um, so if you don't have a sore thumb, just get in, practice the motion of uh, the folks attack to the low punch to the uh, m uh, medium punch to the sonic boom. Just get that down. Um, Practice that second actually. What you want to practice first is just uh, if you can't do it off the top of your head, and it's actually pretty simple because you're just doing it in one fluid motion. You're just doing Sonic Boom to the um, double flash. And um, you'll if you get the, the if you get the focus attack to the low punch, the medium punch down, and you're you're used to getting the Sonic Booms with double flash. Um, for me, I, it, I I automatically do the Sonic Boom Double Flash right after I um, do the low punch to the medium punch. That's the biggest part, I think, actually. It's not actually about the Sonic Boom to the Double Flash. It's just connecting the low punch to the medium punch. I think pressing medium punch twice uh, can throw people off. And when I was starting this off, I was kind of like, okay, I gotta practice this a little bit more. Because I haven't done it in a while. Um, <clears throat> but I... I think that that's really the only... Because um, I could explain um, uh, doing uh, the, the inputs down, but I mean, that's already written in how many threads already. Um, And um, <clears throat> that part here is you'll see I missed the <laughs> I missed the um, the ultra at the end for both of these. Um, <clears throat> what I like to do is uh, it's I'll actually close my eyes sometimes and I get to the the, the motion. Uh, <clears throat> I remember them where uh, I try to picture when Guile is when he falls because uh, it doesn't actually show that the screen goes really up when it shows Dan going into the air. So you kind of have to picture right when you land, this is when you input. You can't do it early or else he won't, uh, the Ultra won't come off. <clears throat> now this is all one shot. I actually tried to do some more today, but my thumb was really sore. Damn holding characters. <laughs> Yeah, but those of you that are still stuck on it, just <clears throat> keep that um, that motion in mind of just uh, breaking it into parts, then combining the two, and uh, whichever part you're having trouble with. For me, it was um, uh, well, I me mean, for me it was actually just combining the two all together, and you have to slowly implement that in there. Um, because <clears throat> low punch to medium punch is easy for me, and sonic boom to double flash is easy. So just combining the two can be rough, which takes trial and error. But uh, that's it, guys. Uh, peace out. Comment below.